Good morning. Today's March 23rd. Um, coming to you from St. Bernard Parish to give you an update on the coronavirus. Our president, Guy McGinnis, had a scheduling conflict this morning, so he's not going to be able to be here with us today, but I can promise you that he's safe and he's well, and he will be here this evening to give you the afternoon update. We all know from the governor's order yesterday that the new numbers won't come out until noon today, so our parish president will be delivering those numbers to you after lunch and keeping you informed as residents. Um, with that being said, I want to talk about businesses a little bit this morning and urge all of our small businesses to fill out your SBA loan applications if that's a route you're going to go. I know they just opened up five more states and I'm sure the application process is only going to get more difficult as this epidemic moves on. So I think it's important that we get our businesses in there as early as possible to try to get some relief. We all know that the bill was blocked in Congress yesterday and so it's gonna take longer to get money to our employees and people that are laid off. And for all the businesses that are holding on and, and keeping employees with jobs, I applaud you and, and keep doing what you do. Our community is um, surrounding around us and, and couldn't ask for a better community in a time like this than St. Bernard Parish. Also, make sure all of your employees are following all CDC guidelines, gloves, Mask, depending on what industry you're in, make sure we're keeping our community safe, we're keeping our employees safe, and keeping ourselves safe. Um, we're all asked to stay home. And, we, and I know that ain't our way of life here in St. Bernard Parish. We like to get out and go to events and, and eat and have a good time. But right now, this is serious, guys, and we need to take this serious. This is lives at stake here. This isn't about your leaders, this isn't about your next door neighbor, this is about everyone's life. We're all in this together, and it's important that we take this serious. So what comes with staying home? I know we go a little stir crazy, and you know, that's, that's part of it. But let me tell you, this week, I spent more family time with my family playing board games than I probably did in the last year. If there's anything positive we can take away from this, it's family time, and important family time, and quality family time. Spend it with your family. I urge you to stay home, especially young people. The most dangerous combination we have is young people contacting our elderly. We need to make sure we keep an eye on our young people and our elderly and keep them separated. We can all talk to each other via Skype or whatever video messaging you have to, to stay close, but it is important that we listen to our federal, state, and local leaders in this matter. Um, and one thing I want to read from John Bell's stay at home order is something that I think is important to us all as uh, we all try to get supplies for our house and we all scramble around, you know, the mass rush for toilet paper. Um, but it says in here, you know, should I stock up on food necessities like toilet paper and medicines? No, you will continue to be able to purchase these items whenever you need them. As stores selling necessary items like grocery stores, pharmacies, and hardware stores will remain open and be frequently restocking. That is important that we make sure everybody gets the supplies they need instead of just some of us buying more than we need all at one time. Let's make sure our neighbors and our community have what they need to get through this with us. Um, a little update on the council. All council meetings are still suspended until further notice. However, we're all, we are all readily available and can be contacted via Facebook, email, cell phone. Um, if, you, if you follow in St. Bernard Parish government's Facebook page or St. Bernard Parish Council's Facebook page and you have a question what you should be doing or is your job essential, whatever your question may be, send that Facebook page a message. Those messages are being monitored. So I'm going to leave you, leave you with this, you know, stay home, stay safe, spend family time and remember, a good smile, a good laugh, that is the sunshine in your house. God bless us all and everyone stay safe.